Hey everyone, I'm here with Scott today to give you an overview of the Solozo dashboard. So Scott, tell us what we're looking at. Uh, thanks, Chloe. Yeah, so we are looking at an overview of our Amazon business. Um, so this gives us a great overview of our total sales, our cost, our profit, our margin, our total A cost percentage. Um, so we can see, you know, both our PPC sales and our organic sales within this view. Um, on the right hand side, we do have like a true profit. Uh, all of that information we gain directly from Amazon's API. The only thing that we don't have is the inbound shipping and the cost of goods. Um, it's really easy to upload those cost of goods, though. All you have to do is just download that template and click the upload button. Um, and then we can go ahead and see the actual true profit for our Amazon business. Um, awesome. if One thing, too, we can do um, is change the date range up here. So it defaults to 30 days. And if we go back to seven days um, or a last 90 day window, it's going to change what all these numbers look like because it'll reflect the, the date range. Yep, exactly. And it's it's nice just to see a great overview. You can see the weekly and the daily and the, the monthly as well, which is really nice. Um, so those are great, great ways to just go ahead and analyze your Amazon business with. For sure. And uh, yeah, so here we have the, the ad automation highlights. So this is really great just to show uh, what actually is happening on your account. You can see that every single day the software is making those adjustments and working, um, just making those automatic adjustments, you know, adding new keywords, creating those negative targets, creating new campaigns. Um, you know, we also can see, you know, what what campaigns we that are not currently optimized or what campaigns need more budget. Uh, or maybe if there's some campaigns that we need to go ahead and raise that ACOS target on, that's also um, available as well. Um, so these are just great great overview of how that software is actually working and, and what we need to actually change for our for our campaigns. Good stuff. And uh, yeah, and if we scroll down here, we also have the inventory value. So we can see based on the like, last current 30 days, day sales velocity, like how long will the products be in stock? Um, this is really great for lead time. If you can see, you know, which products am I going to run out of stock? Uh, you know, if you click on them directly, they take you to the products to, in the product view. Um, but it's just a great overview just to see, you know, what products are currently running out of stock and how long do I have until some of these products uh, run out of stock. Nice. All right. And then lastly, this cool map. Yeah, it's, it is a really cool map. It's uh, it's awesome because you can see, you know, all the different areas to where you're actually getting the Amazon sales. Um, you can click on those little bubbles and that will take you to the individual areas to where you're actually getting those sales. Um, and then also the recent orders on the right hand side that gives us, you know, the most recent orders that are that are happening on our account uh, on a daily basis. Um, so, yeah, this is a really great way to uh, to look at a, an overview of our Amazon business. Awesome, Scott. Thanks for the overview. All right. Thanks a lot, Chloe.